Today we're going to be continuing on with our look at Bruno Mark. If you've missed the first video, I'll put it on a card at the top of the screen here. We went over the black Oxfords in that video and we went all through the details on those. And today we are going to be switching gears and looking at the brown Oxfords. And these are not actually the same shoes as the ones we looked at in the first video. They're not the same shoes just in brown. They're actually different styles as far as the brand goes and what they offer. They actually offer multiple styles of Oxford. So today we are going to take a closer look at these. This is the formal Oxfords from Bruno Mark in brown. And once again, these are budget dress shoes that are made for someone looking for something that is super affordable, but maintains a quality look and feel. And according to their site, the breakdown of the shoes include a polyurethane upper, a lace up closure design, a breathable faux leather lining, a latex cushioned insole for more comfort, a stacked wooden heel and a slip resistant resistant rubber outsole for traction and grip. I also want to point out that they've got these nice accents on the sole of the shoes right here. I really like this, this touch here. This isn't something that we covered in the first video. And I think it's a pretty nice touch added to the overall look of the shoe. Just like the other Oxfords too, these also come in five different color and styles over at their site, which has this shoe priced at $54.99. And again, they are available on Amazon as well. You can even get them for a, a little bit less over there. For sizing, I just ordered my standard shoe size. I'm a size 10. I ordered size 10. There's there's really no problem with ordering just your usual size. They don't run small. They don't run too big. They don't run wide. I mean, it's pretty straightforward. I ordered my usual size and it worked out just fine. Speaking of size, though, it is time to put these on now. And overall, they don't feel much different than the polished Oxfords, even though they're a separate style of shoe. They feel pretty much the same on my feet. Nothing is standing out to me as an issue or you know, feeling weird or anything like that. We did talk in the first video about how budget shoes or cheaper price shoes tend to fall apart due to the cheaper materials. And everything I said there applies here too. I have not stress tested these or anything like that, but they do feel pretty good to me. And when I say they feel pretty good to me, I, I'm meaning they feel pretty good to me for the price point that they're at. I've definitely had shoes that were this price and lower, honestly. I've had some that were even lower than this and the quality has been very evident. So I do think that there is a bit of a difference here, maybe just a slight difference here as far as quality goes. As far as colors and outfits go, just like the black shoes, these can be paired with quite a few things. I don't personally like to pair brown shoes with black pants. Yes, I know some folks do. I'm just not one of those who tends to prefer that, but you got your blues, navy blue, things like that. That looks great with brown and of course gray looks awesome with brown as well. So you've got a couple of different options you can play with. In the end here with these shoes, I do think they're a solid second option from this brand. And once again, I'm not here claiming these are top of the line, top shelf, better than whatever brand shoe. I'm just saying for folks looking for shoes in this price range, I think it's a safe bet that these would work out for you. I think that I think it's a safe bet. I don't see anything, once again, that stands out as a red flag for a shoe that's in this price range. So for what it is, I do think it's pretty decent. That though is it for this one. Remember, we still have one more pair to look at from this brand too. For the next video, we will be taking a look at these mesh Oxfords. So keep an eye out for that. Make sure you're subscribed, get your notifications turned on if you haven't already. Take it easy. I'll see you next time.